Okay, first up in our force file series, we got the counter movement jump. The counter movement jump is one of our most used assessments here at NeuroForce One. The counter movement jump is a jump assessment that measures lower body force and power production. It also assists with athlete profiling, fatigue and readiness monitoring, and allows us to gain insight into training adaptation status. To perform the assessment, we zero out our force plates and then have the athlete step on and hold still while we gather a weight. Then we have them place their hands on their hips and then perform three max effort counter movement jumps back to back. Once all the jumps are complete, we can then take a deep dive into the data. The primary metrics we're looking at here are jump height through impulse momentum, RSI modified, peak concentric force, and concentric impulse. These data points provide reference to how efficiently an athlete produces force. We get to see how much force they produce and how fast they produce it. We're also able to profile the athlete, seeing how well they produce force relative to their population. By gathering this data daily and trending it over time, we're better able to monitor an athlete's responses to training and optimize their training program. We're able to answer questions like, is this athlete fatigued today? Is the training load too high and breaking the athlete down? Is the recovery interval too low between the training sessions? Or is the stimulus in a particular training block not adequate enough to elicit an adaptation? 